Welcome to Stuff and Futurity Tube. In this video, we continue our series of Eat Your Vitamins. In Vitamin A, Part 1, we learned about food sources packed with Vitamin A. And here we're gonna raise your awareness about kale. What is kale? Kale is a nutrient-dense food and a member of the cabbage family. It is a best of all world food, low in calories and packed to the hilt with several vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. The most common variety is deep green, but other kales are yellow-green, white, red, or purple, with either flat or ruffled leaves, according to Berkeley Wellness at University of California, Berkeley School of Public Health. The colored varieties, sometimes called salad savoy, are most often grown for ornamental purposes, but they're edible. Kale is one of the healthiest and most nutrient-dense foods you can eat. Kale is a nutrient-dense food, as it's low in calories and high in many important vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. For example, 1 cup, 21 grams, of raw kale contains only 7 calories but is an excellent source of vitamins A, C, and K. It's also a good source of manganese, calcium, copper, potassium, magnesium, and several B vitamins. This vegetable is likewise packed with antioxidants. These molecules help counteract oxidative damage caused by compounds called free radicals and may reduce your risk of conditions like heart disease, Alzheimer's and certain forms of cancer. Due to kale's nutrient composition, eating it may offer several health benefits, including promoting eye and heart health and protecting against certain forms of cancer. Kale is one of the few leafy greens that doesn't shrink much when you cook it, and it's great sautéed, baked, roasted, and stewed. Just don't overcook it, because it can get more bitter than it was when raw. To get a slightly sweeter, much silkier kale, Drizzle olive oil, salt, and lemon juice while rubbing the leaves together in our hands to quicken the massages process of breaking up the cellulose structure. It's even better than a dry massage. You can cut kale leaves in thin, confetti-like ribbons. But always, always remove the ribs, whether you go raw or turn up the heat. You can trash those ribs or chop them up and throw them into a soup or broth later. However, raw kale also contains a compound called goitrin which can affect thyroid function. Kale is often eaten raw in salads and smoothies but can also be enjoyed steamed, sautéed, boiled, or baked. Raw kale has a bitterness that can be reduced by cooking it. Cooked kale may reduce its content of nutrients, including antioxidants, vitamin C, and several minerals. Compared with raw kale, all cooking methods resulted in a significant reduction in total antioxidants and minerals, including calcium, potassium, iron, zinc, and magnesium. While raw kale may boast the highest nutrient content, the study found that steaming retained the most antioxidants and minerals, compared with other cooking methods. As a result, for those who prefer cooked kale, steaming it for a short duration may be the best way to preserve its nutrient levels. From homemade snack chips to soup, here are some ways to eat this most Open popular Gangnam vegetables. Star. Gangnam Star.
true scale with firm, bright, deep colored green leaves and moist, hardy stems. Rinse the kale under cold running water. Cutting kale is what, one of the nature's miracles. Science tells us that by simply cutting kale leaves into quarter inch slices, you'll open the cell's walls, activate the enzymes, and help form even more help promoting nutrients. Because it takes time for the additional nutrients to develop, it's best to let the kale sit for five to 10 minutes after you cut it. Use stainless steel steamer like this one I'm using. Put the kale in the steamer and set the timer for five minutes. Add one clove of chopped garlic, one tablespoon lemon juice, sea salt and pepper. Three tablespoon extra virgin olive oil. It is important to cut kale a second time because cutting blends all the ingredients together as one and makes the kale taste great. You could add chopped sun dried tomato, olives, crumbled feta cheese, five drops of the tamari soy sauce, 